Can I climb up there? Well, that's a relief then. <laughs> no, no, wrong ones. Wrong ones, sorry. Oh, here come the next lot. No, stand here. Uh, my villagers are going to get destroyed. Where are they? I think I must have highlighted them. Got them pulled in there by accident. Uh, I'll take a couple more. Right, while everything's busy over there, just just pile, dog pile that. That came in. That came in. That's okay. That doesn't matter too much. There's got to be some villagers there. One. Two. It would be helpful if I... What do horsemen require? Oh, that's knackered. Oh, well. That's gone. Uh, give me a gate there, please. You're joking. We didn't even get as far as the tower. There's a massive horde of soldiers over there. Okay. I'm going to have to send things out front to kill everything then. Okay, let's put everything up on the walls. But what we could do with is... All, all those guys, if we could. Spearman, is that how it pronounces? Spearman in English. Okay, I do need to get up there and do some, some hitting. Uh, build me a stable. If I can get a load of horsemen, what was I up against there? Spears and things. Uh, I probably just want a, a load of um, men at arms, don't I? We'll go with that. And we will try and build as many of these defensive units as we can. Offensive units, I mean, sorry. Battering rams. Why the hell can't I... Where do you research flaming arrows? Maybe I can't do it in this age. I did it in the last age, though. Military Academy? Yeah, let's get... We need, we need faster responding troops, definitely. And get armor improved as well. What's this one? Boiling oil. Towers and keeps gain a boiling oil attack. Expensive, but might help. Let's improve the speed of siege engines. Hey, Alexon. You <laughs> want more into the breach? They're coming into the breach once more and once more and once more again. It's, it's insane. So I've quickly gone and just repair this tower. I'm not getting a time to have a break to go and try and hit their towers. And I daren't take the entire force out because then my walls will absolutely crumble. What have we got across here? Do we have... We only have archers on the walls, which, which is fine. I think they can maybe deal with that. Um, hmm, yeah, I just need... I'm <laughs> going to need some more trees from somewhere in a bit. So I'll send these troops out, I think, in a hope that, uh, that the soldiers will be able to engage their their foot troops and then the, the rams might make it through to the damn tower. Here they come again. Let's get that tower knocked down and then that at least will slow things down a bit. It really annoys me that I can't find where to upgrade to fire arrows from. Maybe it's just not possible in this age. Let me just select some villagers. 
Is there a building that I've neglected to, to do? What's that? Town centre. Not as far as I know. Apart from doing a monastery. But monks are expensive. So I don't really want to do that. Right, I don't feel like stone is is worth my time at the moment. You lot, get on with that. You lot. Wow, th those are expensive. I need to... Oh, right, capacity reached. Okay. We'll go off with five rams then. And we will hope... I sense another another mass force building up already. Let's grab all those and just march them out the castle. I'll just queue up some more men at arms. We do have the gold for it, because I suspect. Right. Men at arms at the front. Archers, follow. Spears, follow. So you guys need to engage enemy foot soldiers. I thought it was in the arsenal last time as well. That's that's where I thought. Oh God, they've seen us. They've seen us. Come on. Deal with them. You go around. There'll be another. There will be another group supporting them. I think at the back over there. Maybe I'm wrong. No. Go on in there. Come on. We need to find another way round. If I can get round this now, I can go and batter that thing to death. I just don't want the rams to get destroyed. I don't want them to go through the soldiers, really. This pathfinding, what is this? What is this pathfinding? My rams are going to get wrecked here. Is it down? It's down. Right. Go and kill that. Forget all this. Come on, you need to go over here. Just forget the enemy soldiers. No, 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 no. Try and get through this with the rams. Uh, one Q. I've just pressed something I shouldn't have done. Probably been using my longbow spikes before now, shouldn't I? Right, four rams. If they can get in. Right, now we've got it. Surely to God. Whew. I mean, we couldn't defeat their armies. forces overwhelmed the enemy and cleared the castle's perimeter. That was mad. Defeat the final attack wave? You've got to be joking. Where's the final attack wave coming from? Well, I need to just um, throw some men out there. As long as they only attack in one direction at a time, I'll be fine. Go and uh, fix that quick. I need to destroy the ram. Okay, so when the ram goes, that's fine. You guys might as well run back in now. No point standing out there getting killed. They can't come through a gate. Unless I leave the gate open, of course.
Do you think this might be the next one over here? Okay, let's uh, let's load up. Do with those guys up on the walls about now. <laughs> but if they keep bimbling about like that, I'm I'm quite happy. Try and focus all firepower onto. Oh no, they've moved. What are they doing? Why are they running off over there? They're going out? Oh my god. Because I think there's probably not enough space for them all to fit in on the top of the ramparts, I would guess. Well, those, those idiots are just going to have to die, aren't they? Let them die. There's a gate open. What the hell is going on? Why are gates just letting... It's... Why was that open? Alright, go and deal with them, fellas. Go and deal with them all. We're okay up there. <laughs> you just can't get the staff these days. With the amateurs. I mean, who leaves the front door open like that? Thank you. <laughs> that was a pain in the ass, that level. Looks like the ten good men came and penetrated the defences. Yeah, scaled up the wall, the joint commando forces style. Of Matilda and Henry had swarted King Stephen's siege of the strategic castle at Wallingford. After over a decade of conflict, Matilda's claim to the throne was still alive. So, I guess this is following historical paths. So Matilda won at Wallingford, and then what happened? Oh, let's see what video we get. This this is the be this is the best part. We get the Angevin Empire. It's actually a page from history. The siege. We don't get anything new. That's really really sad. When sad when King Stephen's died, Matilda's son Henry ascended the throne of England. He became the first king to rule over what is known as the Angevin Empire. I think that's how it's pronounced. Henry was an active and ambitious ruler, determined to expand and protect the heart of his empire. He personally travelled the extent of his lands, making deals, crushing rebellions and annexing new territory. Henry acted so swiftly and with such audacity that the King of France described him as seeming rather to fly than to go by horse or ship. But just as Henry's ancestors had struggled to maintain their power, so the Angevin kings would rule for only two more generations before the empire fractured, once again leading England to war. I was hoping to be a cool little uh, documentary after that. Continue. I think they must have had a spy in the city, a traitor, eh? Could be. At Wallingford, in the shadow of the castle, Matilda's faction, commanded by her son Henry, proved it was still willing to fight King Stephen for the crown. But after 15 years of conflict, both sides had had enough. So they made a deal. Matilda would surrender her claim to the throne on condition that when Stephen died, her eldest living son Henry would succeed him. Damn, that war went a on a long time. Later, he was crowned King Henry II and proceeded to grow the kingdom into the mighty Angevin Empire. Angevin. But once again, what the king had spent his life building, his own children were destined <laughs> to destroy. Rebellion. Who will this be? King Henry II had four surviving legitimate sons, and he planned to divide up his kingdom between them. But they fought Jeffrey. bitterly for dominance. Against the odds, Henry's youngest son, John, became king. But King John was deeply unpopular. Hmm. I've not heard of Geoffrey, so I'm guessing he didn't he do very huge well. He swathes of the Angevin Empire gained by his father then failed to reclaim them in expensive battles. Paid for by taxing his subjects. Eventually, 
England's barons could take it no more. They forced John to agree to a charter that restricted his power. The Magna Carta. But he went against his word. Furious, they rebelled, inviting Prince Louis of France to invade England. In 1216, Louis sailed to Dover and set his sights on taking this. Dover Castle. Dover Castle. That's a proper castle. Held by forces loyal to King John, it was commanded by Hubert de Burr. He described the castle as the key to England. He was right. If it fell to the French, so would the kingdom. Okay, so I, I'm going to guess it's going to put us on the castle holder's side in this. For an English empire, Angevin sounds a bit French. They, they were French, technically, I think. Well, they're descendants of the Normans, which spoke French, but were descendants of the Vikings themselves, as in the Northmen, North men, and I think that's where the word Normandy comes from. Or at least that's one story about where it comes from. Uh, but yeah, your English nobility at this time, and for a couple of hundred years afterwards, uh, spoke French and acted in the French manner. And it was quite a long time later that uh, English as a, as a culture, it became trendy to be English at, at this point and speak English and stuff that wasn't thought of. Uh, the nobility didn't do that. That's, that's what the ruffians, the hoi polloi, the peasants speak. We speak French. And I'm not going to do my French accent for fear of upsetting a lot of people. <laughs> okay, the Siege of Dover. This is going to be much like the last one, is it? All right. Oh, my plane is a French. Asked to invade by the rebel barons, Prince Louis's French army launched an assault on the castle at Dover. Opening a crack in the outer defences, the invading forces charged the castle walls. The garrison at Dover would meet the French with clenched fists and an iron will. Dover could not fall. Okay, do we have a pause button? Commander Hubert de Burr rallied his men to hold back the French and defend the castle. Give me some jobs to do. Do we have... We have a little bit of stone. I have no currently spare villagers. Defeat the first French attack. So do I have any more longbows? I'm going to need more longbows, aren't I? Um... Of all non-siege units and bit yeah, let's get that going. Veteran longbowman, please. Don't really want the horses running out because things are expensive to replace. So come back in. We lock the gate. We've got another attack. Oh god, oh god. It's gonna be one of these, isn't it? As long as I just sit on the castle walls, I don't think I can do too much wrong. Do we have any men at arms? We have a few. I think I'll focus on upgrading the longbows first. As long as they don't bring siege weapons, I'll be a happy chap. Where are you lot going? Oi, oi, stop. Yep, an unlocked gate. We'll stop that straight away. Tell you what, we won't. We'll go and kill that bloody battering ram. So, what can we do? What does this do, actually? Network of castles increases the network of castles attack speed bonus. What? What is the network of castles? I, I honestly don't know what that is because I've not seen anything explained to me about it. They just require stone, so I'm going to do that. And hope that those towers While the castle's survive. garrison thwarted the first French attack and prepared for a second, Give me, a um, new resistance force was building in the English countryside. Give me a couple of these. Willikin has arrived in the south. A skilled bowman and fierce patriot, known as Willikin of the Weald, began to muster a resistance to the French invasion. Oh, no, hang on. Long bowman at the wall. Determined to keep the crown in King John's hands, Willikin would rally every available archer to the cause. That's what we like to hear. 
I'd need it, worker. Use Willikin to gather longbowmen from Dover Town. Oh, I see. Okay, so we're what? We're. What are these? Traders. Is this Willikin? So Dover Town is over here. Right, let's just march through then. I don't think I can control this lot. Well, I possibly can. Can I increase the speed at which we're chopping stuff down? Nice music, by the way. If you can hear that flute playing in the background. Morning, Poetic Wine. How's it going? And Lumberjack, hi. French was popular in many courts. Russian young, young nobility was speaking mostly French because it was fancy and trendy. Do you know what? I know nothing about uh, uh, Russians at all in this period. My knowledge of that is, is really, really hazy. When he said go and gather archer recruits, I was kind of hoping it meant more than four. They just look like they're ready to come and make another attack, don't they? So, did we have an arsenal? We don't want that one. We want... Where is that arsenal? We did have it, because I clicked on it earlier. The monastery is expensive. Where is... Where's it gone? I definitely... Oh, there it is. So, we need... Oh, we need gold. bowmen assembled... Willikin planned to ambush the French siege engines okay. on their way to the enemy camp. Let's return then. I mean, what the speaking, it's, uh, it is the gibberish that you get in these games, but it's got like a kind of... You can almost hear like a hint of sort of Saxon Old English in some of it as well, which makes it sound pretty good. Hey, Major Manju, how's it going? You're cooking a 12 kilo turkey for charity? It's got to be a uh, Thanksgiving thing, right? 12 kilos is quite a turkey. It's going to be a monstrous oven. Don't do a Joey from Friends and get it stuck on your head. Or Mr. Bean, in fact. Step us to it, out of way, man. Russian Empire in 1800s, French was a sign of nobility, even after the French invasion. You'd, you'd think after the French invasion, it would be very untrendy in the Russian Empire to speak French. So, uh, optional, produce additional traders. Oh, this is going to generate gold for me, isn't it? Okay. So, I'll do the optional in case it gives us anything. Uh, seven minutes for the next French attack wave. That's not long. Hang on, I can recruit a stack more longbowmen in... Where's the Sodding Castle? In here. Guys, get up on the hill. Where's this? We, we can afford a lot of longbows, so we, we should. Have we got two? No. But I'll upgrade them with the gold from there. So that'll be, that'll be quite cool. Where are we going then? We're going to go and ambush something... Something over here. Oh, more archer recruits? Oh, okay, so I'm just gathering the archer recruits. I'm going to have to be quick then, So I've only got six minutes until the next attack goes. And that's where I need to be. So come on, fellas. Can't move you, can I? I should have been quicker. Come on, come on, come on. Damn you, mouse pointer. Come on, we're going to have to be quick. Run, run, run. There's a second one coming. We definitely want to knock these things down before they get into those camps, though. What's this? We have an arrow volley. That sounds good. Come on. Get death raining down on those things. Willikin spotted a group of English fighters engaged in battle with the enemy and rushed to their aid. All right, let's 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 take out those. Let's click on that. We're going to get some more coming here. Let's also put down the spikes. And just see if it holds. I don't know if it'll hold those guys up at all. Maybe it did. 
that ability seems really nice, actually. Well, they're on our side, aren't they? Right, kill that thing. More archers, please. Keep, keep them coming. Where was my arsenal? Still not enough gold. I better put some longbows up on there. Where's my... Where's my sodding army at? Come on, shoot. Is that... Have I got flaming arrows all of a sudden? Kill that guy. Someone has flaming arrows in there. Heal up, boys. Heal up. We've got um, hold off the French siege. One of four. There's another wave coming. Well, it's good that we are knocking back these siege engines anyway. We should be able to hold off whatever comes, I think, this time. Hey, Cringe. I'm doing well, thanks. How are you? Sorry, I missed your uh, your first message there. Just focusing on this. <laughs> You're not going to do a Mr. Bean with the turkey? Shame. That would be that would be well worth a watch. That would. There's a sneaky one going over at the top. Can we get up here? What does this do? Increased movement speed. Nice. Oh, that is nice. Come on, run through. These happen to join us on the way, that would be really nice. But... Willikin's resistance force continued to grow, adding more skilled men to its ranks. We can improve. Hang on, let's go up there. We can now improve our archers a bit more, ready for the next attack. So we want silk bowstrings, two tile attack range. That would be good. I'll take that. I do want to increase the traders too, but. We will get this done. Come on, come on, come on. We're nearly there. I like this Willikins guy. I like the idea of using leaders in this game, which give like a bonus to the troops. <laughs> Suddenly I become a machine gun. Oh, I like that. That's really nice. Who's healing there? Oh, we've got a priest as well. Excellent. So we've got that. Ambush siege weapons to weaken attacks. Well, maybe there's some more coming. Unless I'm supposed to just run in and kill all the other siege engines as well. I'll leave those guys there, ready to go and quickly reinforce any uh, walls that need patching back up. Doctor said your father should be fully healed in three weeks. That's great news, Cringe. I'm really glad to hear that. Yeah, let's put you guys on control one. Um, well, should we go and try and destroy some more siege engines somewhere? I don't fancy taking on some towers, like. Mm, this place looks like a, a likely spot. They all get oh, they all get the ability to do this. Nice. They have some more things there. Where's the one that increases the speed of recruiting troops? Is it from the castle? It is not. Oh god, what have we found? 